Hey everyone, it's Mike McCalco here and I am going to give you a tour of my new Peisty symbols that are set up on my super kit. I've had a uh, few uh, emails and messages sent to me uh, regarding the uh, models of Pisces and I figured it would be much easier just to do a video than to answer uh, each email individually. That's why you guys can check out the uh, the symbols themselves. Anyways, I'm going to start down over here at my hi-hats, my, uh, my main hi-hats. These are the Peisty Signature. 13-inch uh, dark crisp hi-hats. Um, I like to go back and forth between 13s and 14s just depending on the music that I'm playing, but these 13s are unbelievable. The Peisty dark crisp hi-hats, the signature series, 13-inch. Going up to uh, probably my main crash, we could call it, is the signature series full crash, 18-inch. Amazing, amazing symbol. Okay. Uh, crash over to my right. This is the Signature Series 18-inch Dark Energy Crash Mark One. Very cool looking symbol and very kind of dark and sinister sounding. Really neat kind of overall for everything, uh, every kind of music uh, symbol. Really cool. Uh, going to the middle splash here, I have the Peisty Reflector Series uh, Signature Splash 10-inch. And underneath here is another splash symbol. This is the 2002 series, 11-inch uh, splash symbol. Actually, uh, it's probably my favorite sounding splash ever right now. Very, very cool symbol. And all right, going up here, the one with the holes in it. This is the uh, Peisty Alpha series, 18-inch medium Swiss crash. Kind of a combination of a china and a crash. Really nice special effects. Um, I do like this symbol a lot because I, I've, I've had symbols in the past that have had holes in them from other brands and I find that this guy I can actually ride on for a bit and he doesn't wash out like some other uh, symbols that I've had that look like this. So anyways, very, very happy with the uh, Alpha Series Medium Swiss Crash. Okay. Now right below that is my auxiliary hi-hats. I've, I've uh, liked having auxiliary hi-hats for years. I've always done that with two sets of hats. These are the Signature Series Medium hi-hats, 14-inch. Okay. Sometimes use them as my main. Okay. Let's go up to this guy. This one's fun. This is a 20-inch Peisty uh, Signature Medium Light Swish, 20 inch. Very, very cool sounding swish symbol, China slash crash effect. If I turn it around, I can actually uh, I can actually ride on it and get this really cool trashy sounding ride sound. So it's actually a very, very hip symbol. All right. And uh, down, down here, my little 8 inch Peisty Signature 8 inch splash. Nice uh, little special effect there. Okay. Now over here on my far right is another crash symbol. I usually like to have three crashes on my set. This would be number three. Sometimes I put them on my left, sometimes I put them on my right. Just depends on you know the stage, the miking, uh, the show, really what it, what it depends on. This is a Peisty Mellow Crash 18 inch. So for you guys that are looking for a symbol that uh, uh, is good for a small room, if you got to play somewhere where you got to keep the volume down, the Mellow Crash is a very, very nice symbol, but it still can open up when you hit it hard, so it, uh, don't let the name fool you. Very, very hip uh, and happening crash symbol. Down here, can't forget this guy, the Peisty Reflector Series, Bell Ride 22 inch. This is Nico McBrain from, from uh, Iron Maiden, the Power Slave Ride. Amazing rock symbol. For you guys looking for a rock symbol, Peisty makes a ton of great rock symbols. I really like this guy. I mean, I'm a Maiden fan. I'm a Nika McBrain fan. But this symbol, awesome for rock, but also for pop. I've used it on the blues gig. I've used it on the funk gig. And uh, people are going, what a cool sounding ride. But if you really dig into that bell, it's really, really nice and loud, OK? Um, and uh, another symbol down here, which is my uh, other ride symbol, if I don't want to go for the full on rock sound, I've got the uh, Pisces Signature Series 20 inch Dark Energy Ride Mark II. This is a very nice overall symbol. I've used this symbol for big band, I've used it for pop, uh, funk, some country stuff, all kinds of uh, variety of music. So it's a really nice overall well rounded symbol. That's what I was looking for was something that maybe covers all aspects aside from just rock. So this is a uh, very, very cool symbol. So anyways guys, what I'm going to do for you as well is probably do another 
another video where you can hear each of the symbols. This is just explaining what each of them are, um, what they look like, the series, and I suggest going to Peisty.com. Check out their website. The coolest thing about that website is you guys can listen to each symbol uh, individually in their sound room and the symbols have no effects on them so what you hear is what you get this is actually how I picked out these symbols um, when I was uh, at the NAM show in 2011 I did hit several of them but they don't have every symbol on display so I went into the sound room and man I spent three hours in that sound room checking out all these different symbols and uh, finally narrowed it down to the ones that I really really love and those are the ones that I'm explaining you today. So once again, guys, visit Peisty.com. Great company, great people, great product. All right, guys, we will see you soon. Happy drumming.